Hello. Good goal. Good evening. May I have some more? Good evening. Once again, Once again, good evening, good evening ladies, ladies and gentlemen. gentlemen. Good evening, ladies and, and gentlemen. gentlemen. Can, Can I have, have more reason? We are extremely overwhelmed to welcome you all. To, to the, the Christmas, Christmas celebration so of GLTC and RI and UELCI, a part of our extended family. We welcome Welcome all of you to be part of the program and warm us with your presence. We warmly welcome you with joy in our hearts. And And we are also very happy to to be graced by our chief Chief guest, guest, Right Right. Reverend Indrapati Vijaya Basma, Chairperson GCC and Bishop SSLC. We now invite our principal, Sir. Reverend Dr. Somro Basumatari, to take Today the honors of welcoming our chief guest. Chief guest. Indeed, it's a great joy and honor. 
perhaps I was waiting for an occasion when we can welcome our new chairperson. Just to tell a brief background. Right Reverend Entrapati Vijayabhastar was elected as the new chairperson of the College Council on 27th of September in a UPLCI General Modi meeting held in the country. Since then, I was communicating our bishop, the new chairperson, when he can come so that we, we, we can welcome him. But there was no way that we could make it. And then finally, more blessed occasion, we could contact him and bring him to our campus. And this day is Christmas celebration day today. So I am very pleased to welcome you as the new chairperson of the Global Policy Council, as well as Chief Guest of our Christmas Passover 2022. So we are so here we from Gurukul family. Hardy, we welcome to you, you dear Bishop. Yes. And then, then along with him, him I, I used to say that the Bishop is so great. So so let me tell you what we had conversation yesterday. I asked Bishop, so so are you going to be so calm? Bishop said, little bit of water is there, I got to. And I said, bring her also. Then Bishop says, Pat is here at home, who will look after. But I am happy that Bishop is always with us. So at the moment of our own understanding, out of the four flying flying, now I request our Bishop, our new chairperson, and the judges of this meeting, I am happy as well as the Bishop to come on the stairs, please. We would like to welcome you. Out of the four flying flying, now I request our Bishop, our new chairperson, so, on behalf of all of us, I will be honored to be somebody who is And then, a little elder will be giving them the vote. And then, and then our, our secretary, secretary So, so we will welcome come all, of all of you. You are welcome. You are welcome. Sit back, relax, relax and, 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 and thank you. Thank you.
Thank you, sir. We also extend our welcome to Dr. Jane Joseph, Executive Secretary, UCRCI. And greetings also to those who join us to online streaming. May you, May you all be blessed. Be blessed. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Uh, now, now we should go on, go on to the very important uh, light. Uh, light. Light is the beginning of life, life this world. world. And light is the last generation of our country. country. And, and now we now request the chief guest, the principal of the knowledge, Dr. Dr. Krishna, and Bishop Rama, and also the president to come forward and light the window. Light represents peace, prosperity. Let us pray. God, God I am in we, we come to the end of this meeting. Lord, we believe that you are one among us. As, as, as we have gathered to the city of the world, as we have been to the city, we see the world is made also to the world. We thank you for the heart of the world. You made the world in the future. We thank you for the heart of the world. We thank you for the heart of the world. We thank you for the heart of the world. We thank you for the heart of the world. We thank you for the heart of the world. We thank you for the heart of the world. We thank you for the heart of the world. We thank you for the heart of the world. We thank you for the heart of the world. We thank you for the heart of the world. We thank you for the heart of the world. We thank you for the heart of the world. We thank you for the heart of the world. We thank you for the heart of the world. We thank you for the heart of the world. We thank you We thank, thank you for the for example you have shown to us through your through your coming to this world and living with the glory of God. God. As we have been very present, as we have known that we are here in this world, world to carry on what we have done through your teaching and direction. We thank, we thank you, you for the foundation we have done the entire creation of the world. Lord, at this moment, we thank you for the good reason that you have given us. Lord, we pray to us to be merciful. As we are here, and we are going to look for the common counsel, right to the Lord. We thank you for the leadership of the Council of the Council of the Church. And also, we are going to look for the Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for the great responsibility that you have given me. Grant to me your wisdom and grace and a discerning mind as he is in the church. Bless his family and his prisoners, joy and happiness to each one of them. Be with him and his cousin for the world of Christmas and his church this evening. We also pray for the end of the world of India, the exhibition of the world, and the treasure of the city. We thank the Lord for his mercy and his own to you, who is among the Lutheran churches, guide him and lead him, as he carries all the things that are in the world. Be with all those who join him, bless his family, and unite him there. With your joy and good will, Lord, and thank you for our principal and the Thomas of Brahma Sita, for his dedication to the United States of America. Bless his family and their cause to make friendship.
Thank you for being with all of them in all the activities of the college. Bless their families. Let this Christmas be a time of joy, sharing, happiness, peace, and hope to each one of us. Lord, be with us. Help us to experience the real joy and happiness which we have in you through this program. Let this Christmas celebration be a blessing to each one of us. And we bring, we bring glory and honor to you. We ask all this in the the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you, ma'am, for the prayer. Now we shall all together join the hymn, Hark the Hero Angel Sing, which is also available on the backside of the sheet. And the lyrics will also be projected. Thank you. 
thousand dollars as we were looking at the day, buys this detailed scenery from the Yogi Yogi Yogi. God bless those who listen to the word of God. I now request the college of fire to grace us with the word of God. Follow me, please, if you will have the greeting from our principal, Reverend Dr. Samuel Basel. Yeah. 
baby Jesus who was born in the house of bed to make ourselves bread for life. So we can observe for a fifth mass and our responsibility of sales. This is perhaps the supplemental Christmas, which we call it Good Friday in the Christmas. And of course, we separate. Good Friday is for weeping, sorrow, and this. Christmas is for celebration, joy, and happiness, but not. There is Christmas and Good Friday. There is Good Friday, Christmas. That sacramental union and sacramental sharing of the gift of gift, gift of God is the secret of these celebrations. So, dear friends, just I'd like to encourage each and every one of us who are here, as well as witnessing all night. Let this our celebration. Be celebration of share. First, let us pray the gift of God which is in us and discover and find out what that gift is. And then rejoicing and thanking God that the share is given to others. Or else, there is no point of Christmas celebration. We leave Calvary of poverty. Alicia Spider said, We leave in the Calvary of poverty. So I just inspire. Let the prosperity of Christmas take care of the Calvary of poverty. And let the blessings of this Christmas. Joy and happiness of this Christmas, the gift we have received, we share with us. And I pray God will make this true in this 2022 Christmas help as well. And as tomorrow we move to our respective places, particularly the students, and the staff will be celebrating with the family members. I also expect Christmas wishes all of you take the good tidings of joy with you from Guru. Share this with your friends, family members. Our love and our wishes share with all family members, the congregations, leaders, and friends. With this not once again, I appeal to all the students, carry with you the joy and happiness and share with your friends and come back with plan that we can share together and build up.
the buzzer. I would the buzzer. I would hit it right now. Wonderful performance from our administrative staff. And now, please welcome on stage the songbirds, the nightingales, the Canterbury bird of Gurukul campus. The kids of our campus. Give them a clap while they come up to the dais. We have to see Christmas through the eyes of children. After all, God came as a child into this world. And will the UELCI staff please be prepared? very beautiful. Kids make our life really beautiful. Thank you so much, little dolls. It was so very beautiful to watch you all. Now we request the staff from the UELCI to come and share their number with us. They'll be sharing a Tamil number, Masilla Devan. Following the UELCI item, we will have the choreography from the BD1 students. So please get ready, BD1 students.
आणि माईक
Now we invite the BD1 students to share the choreography with us. BD1 students of GLDC. After the choreography, we will be graced by a special song from the BD2 student which will be shared online. BD2 students. Five and ten, listening once again. Candy canes and silver lanes aglow. <laughs> it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Stars in every store. But the prettiest sight to see is the holly that will be on your own front door.
carol is to sing and dance in a circle for celebrating the birth of Jesus Christ. It is also the way of telling the story of the nativity and the birth of Jesus Christ. In the early days, carol is the way to share the love, joy, devotion, gifts, and to help the needy person. But in present days, the motive of the carol is changed. Let us examine ourselves from this moment. On behalf of BD1, we wish you a Merry Christmas and prosperous New Year. Thank you. Thank you, BD1 friends, for the meaningful play. We will now be uh, graced by a special song from the BD2, followed by the dance from the service staff children. BD2 friends are not with us but still, they are available online. They've shared a beautiful number with us. This is the Sadri language song, which says, Ada Rati Bera, Sunsan Bera. I don't know whether it's right or wrong. It is Sadri language. So let's listen to them. Thank you, BD1 friends. Since it's coming from Ranchi, it'll take some time. We are trying to come by flight. Please hold on. Ranchi is indeed very far. So now we'll move on to the next item, after which we will come back to our BD students. By then, they'll be ready. So now we'll have the dance by the service staff children, the song on Arpudam Adisayam. I invite the children, service staff children, to come forward for the dance.
This can be your next meal. Get up this. Fantastic. Thank you, children, for wishing us a supernatural year to come. 
May this year really be supernatural as you wish this. Thank you so much. Now we will have the Bible reading. Bible portion from Matthew chapter 2 verses 1 to 11. Read by Ms. Maria Asanta from the GLTC and RI staff. The scripture portion is taken from Matthew chapter 2 verses 1 to 11. Now when Jesus was born in Bethlehem of Judah, in the days of Herod the king, behold, wise men from the east came to Jerusalem, saying, Where is he who was born king of the Jews? For we have seen a star in the east, and have come to worship him. When Herod the king heard this, he was troubled, and all Jerusalem with him, and assembling all the chief priests and scribes of the people, he inquired of them where the Christ was born. They told him in Bethlehem of Judah, so that it was written by the prophet, and you, O Bethlehem, is the land of Judah, are by no means least among the rulers of Judah. Uh, from you shall come a ruler who will govern my people Israel. Then Herod summoned the wise men secretly and ascertained from them what time the star appeared. And he sent them to Bethlehem saying, go and search diligently for the child. And when you have found him, bring me word that I too may come and worship him. When they had heard the king, they went the way, and lo, and the star which had they seen in the east went before them, till it came to rest over the place where the child was. When they saw the star, they rejoiced with great joy, and going into the house, they saw the child with Mary, the mother, and they fell down and worshipped him. Then opening their treasures, they offered him gifts of gold, frankincense, and myrrh. This is the word of the Lord. Thank you, Ms. Maria Ashunta, for reading the word of God. I now request our Bishop, Right Reverend Indrabati Vijaya Bhaskar, to please grace us with the Christmas message. Praise the Lord and good evening to everyone. My heart is filled with uh, joy after watching all these events. Uh, from kids to old persons. So, this is a wonderful opportunity which God has given me to stand before such a great people and um, beautiful children. This is the atmosphere which I love very much. Uh, in the midst of uh, many people. Please. Dear friends, I'm not desirable to, I'm not deserving, I'm not deserving, but desirable to stand here as the chairperson of this esteemed institute. So I must be grateful to the Lord who has given this opportunity to stand before you once again. And there are many people uh, who helped me to be here today as a chairperson of this college. I must uh, thankful to Dr. Joshua Peter who is the Executive Secretary of ULCI and um, the Vice President, uh, Mr. K. Jairao, who is the leader of our church, Sotanda Lutheran Church, 
and um, other bishops, those who are uh, in our uh, member churches. So I would like to thank them on behalf of our uh, institution. So I would like to move to, to share this God's word. Very wonderful um, scripture reading we heard. It's a really a great verse. When um, the people who, who are present, a wonderful skit without, uh, without, um, without words, without words. So really a great one. So shall I close our eyes and uh, Pray for the help of the Lord. Lord, may the words of my mouth and the meditations of all our hearts be acceptable in your sight, our rock and the Redeemer. Amen. Merry Christmas to you. Keeping the theme of this year in mind, I titled this reflection as Incarnation Embracing Diversity. Embracing Diversity is the title for this year to this institution. I know that. I look up the dictionary for the meaning of diversity and uh, most of them express that it is including or valuing all people irrespective of their differences in all aspects of life. Diversity also means variety. In light of that, when I read the Christmas story, I realized that the Christmas season is a season of diversity. And it is celebrated in the churches with all ages, genders, caste, and standards. All people want to welcome baby Jesus, the mighty king and the light of the world to their personal and spiritual worlds. As we all know very well, we live in a world where things are uncertain, unparalleled, unreliable, unsupportive, unresponsive and so on, we see lots of negativity around us physically, mentally, and spiritually. It seems the world is the same from its inception. There is also, there is always confusion and chaos. Amongst all this chaos, there is always hope for the creation and it survived till today. And I believe that the driving force behind this survival is religion. Especially Christianity is a religion of hope and love, the variety of diversity of this religion is passed through the generation by telling and retelling the faith stories repeatedly. One of those stories were the incarnation which is the foundation of Christianity. The diversity of this story is a transcendent God becoming flesh and responding to humanity most humanly and uh, giving himself as a sacrifice for the sin of all humanity. So in this reflection, I would like to put before you three ways we can see diversity in the birth of Jesus Christ. We have been celebrating Christmas every year and uh, we need to ask ourselves whether it is the same kind of celebration or whether we have some diversity in it. 
what does it mean for us this Christmas to embrace diversity? What does this story of a little boy born approximately 2,000 years ago teach us? Let us try to unravel the mystery of incarnation together. The text suggests speaking on two verses from the Gospel of Matthew, where we see the Magi looking at the star that had stopped over a barn and overwhelmed with joy, went into the barn, knelt down, paid homage, and offered him the gifts they brought. But as my first thought, I would like to point out the diversity in God's act of incarnation, which we see in the setting of Matthew's sto story of incarnation, starting with a great genealogy at the beginning of his book. Our God is God of all people. Yeah, we could see a skit based on this, uh, uh, this sentence, this word. Our God is God of all people. In the book called The Urban Christian, the author Ray Becke mentions in one of his chapters about the mixed race savior. Mixed race savior. All the years when particular people, let's say Jews, Israelites, and today's Christians, own Christ for themselves, but truth be told that Jesus is God to all and died on the cross for all humanity. We see that emphasis in his lineage. Four out of five women mentioned in the lineage are not Israelites. The first was Tamar, a Canaanite woman who exposed the unrighteousness of Judah and his sons through deception. The second was Rahab, another Canaanite woman who saw the city of Jericho as a prostitute. The third was Ruth, a Moabite woman who was a distant offspring of Luth's incestuous relationship with uh, his two daughters. The fourth was Bathsheba, a Hittite woman who was married to Uriah, a military commander in King David's army. We all know that David killed Uriah so that he could have Bathsheba. Four of the five women in Matthew's genealogy were not only non-Israelites, but they also had scandalous past. And all of it was recorded in scripture. Our God chose to be born in this family lineage and most, most of the people in the lineage are not perfect being except Mary. Everyone in the lineage has a past that God doesn't uh, appreciate, but God chose them all. What does it tell us? Our, bo our baby Jesus chose to born for all humanity, even if we have imperfections. This should also challenge us that we need to break barriers that are sent to us by the communities and the traditions of the church and to embrace people irrespective of social standards and vulnerabilities. Unfortunately, we are still talking about this scheduled caste not being part of the church memberships and its leadership. Discussions on delibera and deliberations over women being ordained. In the church, there is, a, there is still a difference between Dalits and uh, other castes. Seminars like this may have regional feelings and so on when God chose to break the barriers. We, the followers, still trying 
how to keep the barriers alive in our churches and society. The challenge today to all of us to bow our heads, kneel down, and uh, prostrate our egos and selfishness in front of this vulnerable baby Jesus. Ask for forgiveness and ask for the heart of acceptance of the other in our lives. The second thought I would like to highlight in the story of incarnation is the Magi. Magi from different places saw the star, identified its significance, followed it faithfully without a doubt. Rejoiced and worship the newborn king. Remarkably, we see the act of Magi coming to God throughout the scripture. In Psalm 72, 10 to 11, and in Isaiah 61 to 6, when the people come together, the nations bringing gifts, and there is even the mention of frankincense and gold. Then we also see the ultimate Magi event in the Revelation 2, with the new heaven and new earth, a great multitude that no one could number, from every nation, from all tribes and people and languages, standing before the throne worshipping. This signifies God's diverse kingdom. The story of the Magi is generally seen as more than a final plot point in the birth of narrative, in the birth of, in birth narrative. Through them, we see that Magi have less to do with the coming of Christ as a human and more to do with the manifestation of Christ as a God. But the story marks the reintroduction of God's saving plan for the nations pointing back to God's promise to Abraham to bless people from all tribes, tongues, and nations, and pointing forward to the fulfillment of that promise in Revelation 21. The story also gives us a greater understanding of God's beautiful vision for, cult for cultural diversity in his coming to earth. And the Old Testament to the New Testament passages, we see the nations bringing their best gifts, the distinct cultural goods to the throne of Christ. The Magi serve as a preview with gold, frankincense, and a mirror. For the Finally, that uh, Isaiah 60 predicts to come in the new Jerusalem where people from different nations bringing their gifts to the feet of God. Cultural homogeneity is certainly not God's plan from the beginning. The theme of all nations, all people coming together runs throughout the scripture. The story of three Magi not only gives us a theology of diversity, but uh, compels us to care about the things that God cares about. Like the Magi, most of us are outsiders, cast out, who have been brought into the fold of God to incarnation. We all are invited to, man to the manger. This coming of Christ invites us to stop for a second and remember that salvation is free for all people. It also reminds us that the valuable thing that we can offer is nothing but ourselves at his feet as an act of worship. God's vis vision is a multicultural, multi ethnic vision of people 
groups and individuals bringing the best parts of who they are and where they are from. Casting their crowns upon the throne of Jesus, God's kingdom is for all people. All are invited to the manger. Finally, I would like to highlight God choosing of the animal kingdom to be part of his incarnation. It signifies the involvement of nature in his story. We speak and listen to a lot of climate atrocity already committed and shamelessly carried out by humans. And now we are talking about the disaster that is going to happen in a decade or two. Temperatures may continue to rise and many animals, species, species are already extinct and ready to extinct. We are counting them like there are 10 of them that exist and there are 100 of these animals left. This should hurt us. Humanity must take responsibility for all this. But in our humble story, we see the value that God gave to nature. There may be cattle, sheep, camels, donkeys, rats, ants, mosquitoes, and all kinds of sects and uh, animals might be present. The first noises Jesus must uh, have heard were these animals welcoming their king with a joyful noise. The baby boy whose body we partake in was laying on a bunch of hay which the animals eat daily. This baby Jesus was vulnerable and was wrapped in swaddling cloths and place it carefully in the manger. Don't you think it's radical inclusivity? The way God defines inclusiveness may be beyond our understanding of inclusivity. Everything God created participated in the incarnation. We can even see a star is born to signify he is the king. And angels sang praises to this baby boy. He says that whatever God is, there is a diversity. And God is the God of all creation. This message, this message to all of us that we should not tend to live or continue to be comfortable with the people whose thoughts and beliefs are alike. But this is an invitation for us to recognize the diversity around us. Respect to different opinions, listen to others, and embrace diversity. I think this is what baby Jesus taught us through his incarnation. The churches needs this diversity and so do our life stories. Welcome the poor and the needy to your churches and care for them. Let us bring ourselves to the measure of grace and respect the creation. Contribute to saving the planet. Dear friends, this Christmas as you meditate on the incarnation, Try to look for the glorious diversity of Christ and his kingdom. It is radical if this diversity is difficult for us to understand and accept our practice. May our God help us. I will leave you with my final statement that we as created beings are all one in Christ. May God bless us and help us
to embrace diversity. Thank you, one and all. Thank you, Bishop, for beautifully reflecting the Christmas scene as an act of embracing diversity. Thank you for the wonderful Christmas message. May the Lord use you more and bless you more each day. I now request the BD3 student to take the stage and present us with your, pro your item. And I also request the fully hostile inmates to be ready. Followed by a song from the MTH1 student. Messia Pornachi Christmas Vandachi Messia Pornachi Christmas Vandachi
performance uh, it is all give them a thunderous applause like their thunderous performance thank you bd3 students you really kept it live thanks a lot now we request the full air hostel inmates to please come forward and share the special song angels we have heard on high the next will be the next will be the song from the faculty So the media team please be prepared very angelic thank you so much fully hostel inmates now we will listen to our faculty the special song by the faculty we are missing half of them in the campus they have gone to serampur on the duty but so dutiful of them and so mindful of them to have recorded this song for us and we are going to listen to them let's get ready to listen to our faculty we have been missing their voices for 2 years and now we are going to listen to them yeah
It was indeed a wonderful song. Of course, we had a little bit bricks here and there, but still, it was awesome. Thank you so much, dear faculty members, for taking the next.
Son. God gave his Son. Son gave his Spirit. Spirit gives his love. So we can give the gift of love and the gift goes on. Now we have the gift distribution ceremony, which will be first taken over by Rebecca Madden. I request Ms. Rebecca to come forward. Rebecca Madden to share the gifts with students, followed by our faculty, Reverend Dr. Shakti Sudhakarnika and Reverend Dr. Vinod Silas to give, share the gifts with the administrative staff and the vendor. Christmas is a time of sharing and Gurukul College Administration has decided to give dear students. So now we request our dear students, BD1 class to come on the stage to receive your gift. The whole class will come. And I request our chaplain, Reverend Dr. Simpagari, come and hand over the gifts to the BD1. I request the class. All the BD1 students. Thank you, sir. Thank you, the class. PDQ is in Ranchi and kids uh, in the field for that. Now I request BD3 come to the stage and I request Reverend Dr. Peter Singh please come forward and give the okay. I request all the BD3 students. Hey, 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 you're not doing it. <laughs>
Now we request the BD4 class to receive your gifts.
Now I request please two friends to come to the stage and I request Last but not the least, we have Dr. Scott. Thank you. 
The child is not available here. Please, respective parents, come and collect your gifts. Baby Asher, son of the Vidyanda. Baby Asher, son of the Vidyanda. Lumpur Geta, Sanam Rosa Salam. Lumpur Geta, Sanam Rosa Salam. Vidyam Jayada, Sanam Usi Sabida. Vidyam Jayada, Sanam Usi Sabida. Jona, Dr. Mr. Krishna. Jona, Dr. Mr. Krishna. Rachel, Dr. Mr. Kandaisa. Rachel, Dr. Mr. Kandaisa. Ivanina, Dr. Mr. Satya. Ivanina, Dr. Rathmus is Satyam. Lumkain, Dr. Rathmus Capital New Me. Lumkain, Dr. Rathmus Capital New Me. Yes, it's all. Four percent. This one here. Son of Mrs. Vanida. I swear again. Son of Mrs. Vanida. Nakul. Son of Mr. K. Dalish. Nakul. Son of Mr. K. Dalish. Rinkit B. Below. Son of the Vanida. The Vido of the Silas. Ankit B. Below. Son of the Vanida. The Vido of the Silas. Thank you for the Um, 
No hay recursos para no hay recursos para to give the prices. No hay recursos para no hay recursos para dar the son grandes maldades to give the prices. Lutren taki sanam rosan sana. Ma sanam misis masochi meta. Ma sanam misis masochi meta. Vika sanam reverend doctor Giri Krishna. ಡಾಕ್ಟರ್ <laughs> 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 Jambia and Rana, Dr. Rao Mrs. Epsima, Angel. Jona and Neil, Dr. Rao Mrs. Epsima, Angel. Dilsi, Dr. Rao Mrs. Vinod Kumar. Strawberry, Dr. Rao Mrs. Vinod Kumar. Dilsi, Dr. Rao Mrs. Vinod Kumar. Strawberry, Dr. Rao Mr. Vinod Kumar. Strawberry. DJ Danny Ra, Diyarsni, Dr. Rao Mr. Dr. David Joseph Ra. Danny Ra, Diyarsni, Dr. Rao Mr. Dr. David Joseph Ra. Clarita Thomas. Dr. Rao Reverend Thomas Pirla, Clarita Thomas, Chen, Dr. Rao Reverend Thomas Pirla, Jasmine Sibia, Dr. Rao Reverend Joy Sister, Jasmine Sibia, Dr. Rao Reverend Joy Sister, Thank you, sir. Now we request the Reverend Dr. Daniel Kibarat sir to come forward to give the gifts. Judy Devak Rubai, daughter of Reverend Chai sister. Judy Devak Rubai. Judy Devak Chai Kumar, daughter of Dr. Aravin Chekumar Bodhi Raj. Blessing Dr. Law Paipitik Newby. Musar Kima Dr. Law Nasab Sula. Olivia Dr. Law Mrs. Yudis Rajamadi. Yencha Dr. Law T. Chandra Sekhan. ಜೂಸ ಸರ್ ಆಫ್ ಮಿಸ್ಟರ್ ರಾಸೇಂದ್ರನ್ ಅಭಿಷೇಕ್ ಗೋವಾಸ್ ಸರ್ ಆಫ್ ರೆವರೆಂಡ್ ಡಾಕ್ಟರ್ ಮರ್ಕಿನ್ ಸಿನೋಜ್ ಗೋವಾಸ್ ಪಾಲ್ ಜೋಶುವ ನಾಯಕ್ ಸರ್ ಆಫ್ ರೆವರೆಂಡ್ ಡಾಕ್ಟರ್ ಬಾಬು Dijin Danik Joseph, son of brother David Joseph Raj. 
and who be Vinod, son of Roman daughter Vinod the Cyrus. And friend Levin Che Kumar, son of daughter Levin Che Kumar Varinas. And real son of the friend Dr. Wilson Pandori. Thank you, son. Now, my request, Reverend Joyce, um, sorry, Reverend Chan Pradeep Kumar to come forward and give the gifts. Hi, Swap, Samu Mr. P. Babu, Sam Ignition, Son of Mrs. Mosonji Mehta, John Mayer, Son of the Chandra Sekhar, Dr. of Mrs. Ramani, Prasanna, Dr. of Mr. Vinod Kumar, Aldrina, Dr. of Dr. Sankram Paswadhyay. Vishnavi, Utsalna, Aldrina. Age group 16 to 18 boys. Alra, son of the Lord of Sangram Pusimatari. Anish, son of the Lord of Giri Krishna. Jom, son of the Lord of Aungla Chayanti. Kashmir, Anandana, son of the Lord Mariana Thank you, sir. Now my request to our doctor Yetrit Chavaraj to come forward to do the basis for gifts. Nisha, Sunna, Mrs. Sri Tevi. Nisha, Sunna, Mrs. Sri Tevi. Ms. Kachina Devakarubai, Dr. of Mrs. Asha Gasol, Sakti, Dr. of Mr. Ravi Chandran, Bharti, Dr. of Mrs. Ravani, Bula Ivanchanit, Dr. of Reverend Dr. C. Babu, Yechala, Dr. of Reverend Dr. Wilson Padori, Christopher, Dr. of Mrs. Rebecca Sariya, Sundariya Kaili, Dr. of Reverend Dr. D. Saval Sandala Singh, Shaini, Dr. of Reverend Samuel Logan, Arkhamian, Dr. of Mr. Ravi. Thank you. Thank you so much. The gifting is wonderful. Please remember, love the giver who than the gift. Now, let's move on to a very special moment of the day. We have a person who comes to meet us. Okay. 
I'm sorry. If there is a gifting still pending, staff, uh, faculty, it is very important. Sorry. Getting up. Now it will be taken over. It's good. And in matter. And quite all the staff, the service staff, administrative staff, wants to come together. This is Christmas. Then one question is Correct. Names are different. You have to check, otherwise, you can have the big Master, after what? Master, the Oh, I have a chapel. I'm going to give us a book. Hey, that's a part of the book of the IO. Hey, what is it? 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 I'm <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
This man comes once in a year and he comes with so much of happiness. He has a long beard, he dresses in red and white, and he's all the way. So we go to bed from a very special person. All the students, all the staff, all the faculty. I take this opportunity to thank the Guru College of the Chair Council, the chairperson. The office matters. Thanking them for the gift given to us for the years of Christmas. On the basis of all of us, which is very Christmas and happy to get for the thousand dollar part. Thank you. Why are you here? Why do you came? Who gave permission to come like this? Oh, 
Who are you? Why are you coming here? Did you take a permission from chaplain, sir? Did you take permission from principal, sir? Oh, oh sorry. I am from China. Oh, China. you are from China. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay. Tata is from China. Tata, come this side, China. They can't see you. China. Yes, Tata. Actually, Tata is uh, speaking a Chinese language that we doesn't know. If Tata speaks, then I will translate for you. Yeah. Come on, Tata. Oh, it was very cold. I came to see you with lots and lots of struggles. I came to see you all. I like you because because I love you. I love you all. You come from China to see the mina. Oh, from Kolkata. Okay, you went to Kolkata. Oh, you gave a special gift for our Gurukul community. Same. 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 Please put it. Without stacking, at least put this video. Santa Claus. TV is calling. Oh, God bless you. Oh. 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 And happy Tata is having a kind of uh, gifts to you all. Yes, come on, Tata. They won't beat you, Tata. You tell Tata. From the Calcutta. Oh, you meet the Arvind sir. Okay, what Arvind sir told? His wife. Oh, he's missing his wife. Oh my God, Arvind sir is missing his wife. He wants to convey her, ma'am. Okay. Oh, he told a flower name. Yeah. What flower? Jasmine. No, 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 no. No, not that Jasmine. Aka. Then? Oh, da, 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 da. I can't get you the da. Rosa. Da, 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 da. Then? Da, 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 da. Small but bigger. What da, da? Da, 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 da. Oh, Lilia. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. Da, 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 da. Lily, ma'am. Sar is missing you so much, ma'am. Please utter the call, ma'am. <laughs> Oh, he's asking you to eat well, ma'am, because oh, don't eat. you don't uh, worry, ma'am, sir will come soon. Okay. Speak that, Chaplin, sir. Chaplin, sir, is very strict, you know. Because he takes utterance. Even many of the chat today is Kali. Because R is so worried about that. Okay, Tata. Then, Tata. But Sar, he loves you, sir. sir. Santa Claus loves you. He will give a gift, sir. Okay. Oh, DK, sir? DK, sir, is your pet. Oh, my Tata. Okay, Tata. Then, Tata, then what message you have? Oh, you also white. DK, sir, also white. Both are white, sir. 
Okay, bye everybody. We wish you a happy Christmas and happy new year. Song song. Come all the children from the community, please come forward. We'll have a cute dance along with the Santa class. I request all the children to come forward. Thank you all. Thank you so much, Christmas Tata, for visiting us. Thank you all. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Thank you so much. It was wonderful. We enjoyed the presence of Santa and his costly Santa. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, friends. Now I request the media team. popular demands we will have the again again the faculty song been played for us as we missed it in breaks so we now listen to the song with the faculty once again as we prepare
Hi friends. Hello student friends. Hi friends. <laughs> Hello everyone. Hi friends. Hi friends. Hi friends. Merry Christmas and a happy new year. Seamless and lovely. Thank you so much. Thanks once again. We have come almost to the end of the program. And I now would like to request Reverend P. Joyce Esther to please share the word of thanks. Good evening, everyone. Christmas is a time to be grateful. Feeling gratitude and not expressing it's like a wrapping a present and not giving it. So I would like to share the Christmas gift of gratitude to all you this evening. On behalf of Gurukul Lutheran Theological College and Research Institute, on behalf of the entire community, first of all, I extend my most sincere thanks to the Almighty God for making today's event a resounding success with God's blessing and grace, we are able to make this event what it was. On behalf of GLTC family, I extend a really heartful thanks to our chief guest, Right Reverend Entrepathy Vijay Pascal, Chaperson GCC and Bishop of SALC, who spared time from his vicious schedule to grace the occasion. Today, we had an opportunity to hear your thoughts and this will surely going to be encouraging us in the future. Once again, our heartfelt gratitude to Bishop and Bishop Amma for gracing the occasion and sharing the Christmas message today. I also extend my thanks to Reverend Dr. Joshua Peter, the Executive Secretary of UELCI and Treasurer of GCC for his enormous support and wishes for this program. An uh, event like this cannot happen overnight. The wheel started rolling months ago. It requires planning and a bird's eye of details. We have been fortunate enough to be backed by a team, a very proactive and dedicated staff of uh, in our institution who well versed in their job. I'm short of words for their involvement and their willingness to take the completion of this program by beyond their comfortable zones. A special mention to our respected principal sir, Reverend Dr. Sangram Basmathari, for being the catalyst and stimulated us to be the best standing pillars of our strength. Thank you, sir. With a deep sense of appreciation, I thank our dear madam, Mrs. Rebecca Aseria, the convener of this program, as well as the Community Fellowship Committee and all its members for the successful completion of this program. And I also would like to thank the core committee members such as food committee, decoration committee, gift committee and program committee under the leadership of Reverend Dr. Shanti Sudha Monika, Reverend Dr. Vinod Silas, Reverend Dr. Giri Krishnan, Reverend John Pradeep Kumar, Dr. Mary Kath, Reverend Dr. Wilson Paluri, Reverend Dr. Nagia Swami Swamivel, and all the student friends who helped in all the committees along with the faculty members. I would also like to thank the people who worked behind the scene to make this event happen. Special word of thanks to Dr. Arvind Jayakumar, Staff Council Secretary, and Reverend Dr. Samuel Saundaraj Singh, sir, GLTC Media Committee, and all its members who helped in PPT recording, PA system arrangement, and setting the light, Mr. Robinson, and all the musicians and participants. Our sincere gratitude goes to all the administrative staffs and service staffs, as well as well wishers of your rock solid support system and encouragement, particularly PR Rosa, the principal office, the finance office, and campus manager. With your support, we are not being able to achieve this far. Thank you very much. 
Finally, I would like to thank our rock stars of GLTC as well as UELCI who made this event joyful with their impressive performance. Your days of hard work were evident in your acts. All the programs were very good and we enjoyed. I immensely thank our MCs of today, Ms. Anita as well as Mr. Butler Chuban for their efforts to wear anchoring today. Last but not least, I thank each and every one of you who made this Christmas celebration 2022 as a memorable one. Thank you, one and all. And a special announcement from the food committee. There are three counters are arranged. One is for the guest and for the faculty members and staff members. You can have it in the Foley Hall. The other two counters are arranged in the open, uh, open stage area. Make use of it. And also special lemon tea also made for you. Enjoy. Thank you very much. Thank you, uh, Reverend P. Joyce Esther, for your kind words of gratitude. We also would like to thank you for all the efforts that you have made to make this program a successful one. Shall we all rise up together and sing the hymn, Silent Night? After which, I would request our chaplain, Reverend Dr. Wilson Puluri, to close the event and bless us with a benediction.
let us pray god of goodness we give you praise for the ordinariness of christmas that the day comes the same as any other day lord we praise you that there is no sign in the heavens no bright star but the very light of your presence in the ordinary birth of the child lord we give you thanks that you are at the center of human affairs involved in the struggles of life and sharing human experience we give you praise that out of compassion you take our part and open to us a new way of life lord we pray that this christmas may we be able to see its true glory may we be able to experience your real presence in the challenges difficulties and the opportunities that we have in our lives we thank you lord for helping us as a community to celebrate this season meaningfully help us to continue to spread the joy and peace of christmas wherever we go we thank you for our leaders our dear bishop ayya and amma and for their presence with us we thank you for this beautiful community that we have where our joys sorrows comfort and strength lies we pray o lord that may this community grow strength to strength and be a model an example to others of what christ like being is help us during this season that we will continue to spread the joy and peace that you have laid in our hearts we ask this prayer in the precious name of lord and our savior jesus christ amen let us receive the blessings may we be filled with the wonder of mary the obedience of joseph the joy of the angels the eagerness of the shepherds the determination of the wise men and the peace of the christ the child may the almighty god son and the holy spirit bless us and all those who expectantly wait and seek the presence of god in their lives amen thank you very much indeed it was wonderful may this light be with us in our di- life every day and it is share this light for our friends and make the darkness expel from this world and wishing you all a very merry christmas and a very blessed new year it is all appreciate each other with a big clap i know your candles are in your hands it is all given applause for for each and every one of us who had made this event happen and i hope you also enjoyed as we enjoyed it with you god bless you happy holidays bye